Ah, uh, hello and welcome to more World War II 172. Uh, we're looking at a very cool vehicle uh, and a first in our series because this is a Hungarian vehicle. This is known as the Nimrod. <clears throat> it's an anti-aircraft tank. It's got a 40 millimeter Bofors gun in it. And if you look at it, you can see that it's very reminiscent of the German Werbelwind and Ostwing type vehicles. Uh, this is a very heavy die cast model. Got a crew of four in there. Not easy to shove that many folks in there. I uh, didn't have the exact decals for it, so I had to do the best I could on that for the moment. Their markings with the red and green and white. Turret turns. Got a cool paint job. I've got a book on uh, Hungarian armor. They had some things from the Germans, but they did make some of their own. And it really wasn't that strong because they had to go up against the Russians. Like I said, this is an anti-air tank, craft tank, but it's a Bofors, so it did have some anti-tank capabilities, different types of shells in there. Uh, very interesting looking. I'd uh, like to get another one of these. These die-cast models, sometimes they don't come with very clear instructions. It's just a little pa piece of paper with the one little line drawing, so it's hard to figure out. And some of the pieces, I had to make to go, to fit. Ah, uh, look at it in there. Very nice. We have a few other types of Hungarian vehicles. They fought with the Germans and they were sort of forced to keep fighting with them right up until 1945. Late in the war, end of 44, 45, there was a big battle of Budapest uh, with the Germans, Hungarians against massive uh, amounts of Soviet. All right, that was something different. Until next time, more tank talk, World War II, 172 scale. Thanks for liking and subscribing. Thank you.